Good morning, Hiram. Welcome to another edition of Hornet Nation News. In this week's edition of Hornet Nation News, we are excited to present you the pep rally, final senior football game, Halloween highlights, and our special message for JROTC. I'm Xavier. And I'm Solomon. And we start off this week, we have some crazy events that happened at the pep rally. I honestly don't think you're ready for this, but let's have a look. Sending off the scenes in a different style this year, we had our amazing pep rally where everyone gathered around and enjoyed the fun. And you can just hear the screaming and excitement from all of the challenges. I really hope all of the seniors have an amazing journey in their life. Wow, that really was crazy, man. I told you so. Now on to some other topics. A more heartwarming event, we have our last senior football game and their huge win against Woodland. Instead of sobbing over their last game, the Hiram Hornets went out with the bang. The band and the Chiliers all played through the whistle and they kept their heads high as we fought through each battle. They truly left it all on the field. We wish you the best of luck next year. Wow, that's really great that they enjoyed their last game. Indeed it was. Now on to some spooky events. That's right, we have to show you our Halloween highlights from social media. <laughs> Halloween was intriguing, with some experiencing joy and some experiencing closed doors and silence. I can say it was quite the night. Wow, that's some really spooky business right there. Now we have an important message from our honorable Jer OTC about what we are doing for our community. Let's have a look. Hiram High School family, I'm Captain Murray, your JRTC Senior Army Instructor. We would just like to thank you for participating with us here in the JRTC Department to make this service learning project of 2022 the most successful one we've had yet. I'm Cadet Captain Julian Alexandre. Hello, I am the Cadet Command Sergeant Major of the Shooting Battalion here at Hiram High School. And every year we have a service learning project and this year we decided to partner with Helping Hands of Paulding to give to families that don't have as much or that are in need. So around the school, we set up barrels where people can give perishable items, non-perishable items, and clothing, like food, like meat, canned foods, and then clothes that they're not wearing or clothes that they, that they just want to give away. This is a very important opportunity for our community to come and help each other. Um, this really helps our community and um, will ben really benefit them. And by your giving us your non-perishable, perishables, and closed donations that will help out the many shelters and many families in need during this holiday season will mean more to them than you will ever know. And I'm quite sure Helping Hands of Paulding would agree with me in saying thank you, thank you, thank you for helping make this holiday season and our service learning project a great success. Blessings. We're so glad we have such an amazing community here at Harm. That's right, but before we end today's news, we have some important announcements. That's right, we still have our pennies for potting, and you can donate today and get your amazing breakfast treat in first period. Also, don't forget, dual enrollment deadline for West Georgia ends November 15th. But that's all we have for this week's edition of Corner Nation News. I'm Xavier. And I'm Solomon. Signing, Signing out. out.